Hey, I'm Hannah Bronfman and I'm the founder of HB Fit. And my husband and I have a house in Amagansett that has a huge, huge fireplace. And it's really beautiful, but we also kind of thought it looked a little outdated. So we decided to give it a makeover. All right, people, we're about to paint our fireplace white. There's Hannah in the back getting some water ready. So the fireplace in our living room is enormous. It actually like takes up a majority of our living room. And so we really wanted to have it be a really beautiful piece and aesthetic in our living room and kind of tie together what we want to do and creating that beautiful white fireplace is really going to tie in to the semi-modern farmhouse that we are slowly but surely dreaming of. First things first. Got to vacuum out the whole area. We're going to leave the back black, obviously, because it's just going to burn, and we're going to paint the rest white. So my husband had heard about this amazing paint that they used to use on the outside of houses in Belgium. We contacted this paint company. They sent us the paint, which actually came as powder form. We mixed it, and it took us a total of six hours to do the entire chimney, which actually has three different fireplaces on it. And I'm gonna show you guys what it looks like. Let's get our paint on. Let's do it. Less reading, more painting. So we started by buying some plastic that we could cover the floors in. So we taped down the plastic all around so that we weren't gonna get paint on our carpets or our floor. We also then taped off um, the inside of the fireplace so that we, because we weren't gonna paint the inside of it white. And then we basically mixed the paint, which came in a powder form, and you mix it with five quarts of water. Mixed it with the powder. You actually put the powder in and let it sit for five minutes before you mix it. Then you mix it up and it gets quite thick. And then we both just applied the paint to the brick uh, without having to treat it in any way first, which was awesome. It was kind of amazing. Went on great. We didn't even have to do two coats. It really like created a beautiful texture in the end and it was pretty fast drying, even though the instructions say that it takes about a month for it to fully dry. It seemed like it was dry in just a couple of hours. So we decided to do the bottom chimney on our first floor first, which was kind of a lot. It was three very large sides. And after it dried, we kind of were so in love with it that we decided to do the second half of the chimney, which was on the second floor, and it had two different fireplaces. Um, that actually took a lot longer than the first go, just because we had two fireplaces to do, and it was a little bit more square footage, but we are really obsessed with the outcome. We are constantly trolling Pinterest to kind of figure out what exactly the vibe is for our country farmhouse that's like in the woods. So this was a really fun and easy project for me and my husband to do together. Um, it was not only some quality bonding time, but really it was a pretty simple thing that we did that gave our home a huge upgrade. We absolutely love the way it looks. Waking up there, it feels so much bigger and more spacious. And we're really excited about it being kind of like the gateway to other renovations that we're gonna be doing at our house. I'm Hannah Bronfman, and to see more projects that we'll be doing at our house, be sure to follow me on Instagram, at Hannah Bronfman.